How is it going guys? Slippy Jim here. Welcome back to my 7 days that I played through. We are on day 10. And overnight, <clears throat> I just decided to uh, dig out the escape tunnel one block higher so that I can uh, run or walk through here instead of crouching the whole way. And that worked out pretty good for me, so pretty happy with that. Let's just close that. Anyway, what we're going to be doing in this episode is going exploring and we are not going to stop until we have found a cave because we need to get some iron and some stuff like that so we can make ammo. There's no two ways about it. Um, just before we do that though, I'm going to put down some more, um, some more spikes here. So I've got my second layer happening. Let's just get rid of that. Gore block there. That's such a disgusting noise they make when they break. Okay, we'll put down the rest of these. I don't know if I crafted enough, actually. Might have to craft some more up. Let's just take a look. Have I got any logs on me? No, I do not. Oh, well, I have got more down in the chests. So... We'll go down and grab some in a second. Cool. Let's get some more... Some more lug spikes happening. Let's get down here. Yeah, I'm fairly certain we have some of these. Log spikes 20, that should do it. Definitely. So close that. Now, um, one other thing that I made overnight is uh, some coffee. So basically just get the coffee beans, brew it up in the campfire with some water, and hey presto, you have coffee. And coffee is almost as good as beer for stamina regen. So we'll probably do, be doing a lot of running away from zombies and things. I imagine. You know, exploration. Okay, let's upgrade these now. This repair tool's lasted a fair while. It's pretty awesome. Once I get some scrap iron going, or some iron from uh, if we find a mine or a cave, uh, then we'll upgrade these to the iron tip spikes as well, because they're that one level better. But I'm not planning on staying in this little base forever anyway. Just until we find something decent to make our permanent base. Uh, the other thing that is worth mentioning as well, once they do a major update, and I'm really looking forward to the next update to 7 Days to Die, because they're going to be introducing stuff like bears in the wild, as well as uh, uh, the mini bike. So that's going to be a lot of fun to be able to ride that thing around once you find it and build it, stuff like that. So, But the problem is, once they bring in a major update like that, the whole world gets wiped, pretty much. So um, at that point, everything is going to get reset. We're going to have to start, start over. I need some more wood, I think. Let's go down and get some more wood. I've got tons of wood down here in my crates. The storage crates, storage chests, I should say. So I did put some more in over this side as well. Because uh, these ones were getting pretty full. That should be enough for what we want. Close that. Close that. And what we're we doing, upgrading these. Let's just kill this zombie. Oi, stop beating on my house. Wow, she just broke those just like that. That's crazy. Stupid zombie. Can hear them creeping up on me back there. Yeah, these spikes, if they attack them from the side, they do get destroyed pretty quickly, but... Um, if you if you put like um, another like la layer of material 
to protect them like this. Um, you can make them pretty much last a lot, lot longer. Where's my club? Just keep it, keep uh, watch out for those um, those dog hordes as well. They were pretty pretty alarming. So I'm just using the ash felt here that I dug up, um, sort of to build this out a little bit. So, so I've got a little bit of protection for the spikes here. Back there. This ash felt is super hard material as well. So, they'll have trouble getting through that, that's for sure. There we've got at least two blocks there of it. They seem to come from this direction a lot. For whatever reason. Let's destroy this. And put that there. How many have we got there? Fifteen. So we just use those here, I guess. Fifteen, nine. Extend this a little bit. That'll do. Oh, where'd that bit? What the hell, man? Get with the system. I think I got. I think I got that. There we go. There we go. That's better. Looks kind of neat. Everything's upgraded like it should be. Cool. Good, good, good. All right. I don't. I still don't know how those zombies got across there, man. Like, if I tried to get across there, see, I would fall down in. I would fall down in here. Oh no. Oh no no no. Oh no. No 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 no. Oh no no no. Oh. Oh, it's not doing me too much. There we go. Oh, God. <laughs> I seriously thought I was going to die. I was stuck. I was stuck in there. Damn it. Let's take it out on this zombie here. Um, Alright, let's look at where we're going to travel here in our exploration. So this is our base. Now, we've explored a little bit in this direction. Let's try and go over here, maybe. Over here in this direction. And see if we can't find a cave out there, because that would be nice and close if we could. Where is that? Over in this direction? Um, I need to get some health back. I haven't got any food, but I have got a little bit of drink, so... Um, why did I eat both of those? That was a waste. Anyway. Um, let Actually, I have got some food, but I don't want to really take it with me. Because it's going to make the zombies smell me from a long distance away, which is that boiled pork. Um, let's just close this. I'll just chuck some of this stuff out. Uh, some of this we want to keep. I'll get rid of that. And that. Everything else we want to hold on to, I think. I'll take that with me as well. And uh, how much fuel have, fuel have we got? 43. Uh, yeah. Okay. Actually, do I have any water here? We'll find plenty of water. I'm sure. Alright. Good, good. Okay, so we're going to head in this direction. Let's go for it. Thankfully, my busted ankle has repaired itself. Or healed. I should say. Just trying to spot where my escape tunnel comes out. Oh, it was over here. Somewhere. Get me some more eggs. We might actually hunt some pigs as well. It's over there. It's probably over in this direction, isn't it? Oh, it was over here. Yeah, there it is there, see? That's a good distance away. It's definitely far enough away. 
Okay, we want to head over in this direction. So let's keep an eye out for pigs. Where's my bow, actually? Um, let's get our bow on. Ready to hunt. See what we can find over here. Still heading in the right direction? I think so. Where is a cave? Let's jump down over here. I want to be really careful that I don't break my leg again. So if we could find one really close, that would be ideal. Just don't know how likely it is. What was that? That sounded like uh, sounded like a pig getting attacked by zombies. Where is it? We might be able to sweep in. Oh, it's a deer. Definitely sounded like a pig. God damn it. There you go. Let's just um get the meat out of this guy. And I guess we'll take the leather till we run out of space, and then I'll throw it out. I sh I have to kill more of these guys because they do have ammo on them now. Sometimes. There we go. See what did I say? We've got a fair bit of ammo now for the SMG. It's super low powered though, so it probably won't last very long. We start shooting stuff with it. It's not my favorite. Seven days to die again, that's for sure. Um, no cave system. I don't know if we're going to get lucky. Can't even find eggs. Uh, how far away are we? This is just down the end of the road, basically. Okay, let's go across here into this biome. Nothing down there. Nothing down there. We've got to come across one eventually. Alright, we're going to get in trouble, aren't we? We're going to get stuck out in the middle of nowhere. Um. Oh, there's a town over there. I saw a lamppost. We'll go check that out in a second. We might be able to stay overnight in that. In fact, we're going to have to. You know it's a good shot when the zombie does that. <laughs> uh, you've no, you know you've hit a critical when it spazzes out the zombies big time. Hey, little deer. Come back. It's too far away now. Try and get the sneak attack on him. There we go. Let's go harvest that venison, that sweet, sweet venison. Man, I really need to drink. Take that, take that. Get rid of that. Um, I should make some scrap armor for you guys to check out. It's it's pretty cool looking. Like, it's not the best armor, but it looks pretty beast. Uh, yeah, this just looks like... Oh, it could be bigger than I thought. Lead weights. Alright, we'll go over here. Let's check out this little town here. And uh, this is where we'll, we will spend uh, the night of day 10. Um, let's kill the little couple of zombies that are here. Hey bud, what's up? Uh, have you got some fuel for me? Interesting. We could make a backup, I guess, for the um, auger just in case I somehow lose 
the one I've got. Get these fuel cans. So, oh my goodness, dude. What are you doing, zombie? That was my fuel can. Stupid, stupid zombie. How deep is that hole? That's well, not that deep. Let's get down in here. So hopefully we can find a little bit of water. Let's have a look in this esky here. There we go. I really need that. Well, she's going ham on that. Let's take this lady out over here. Nothing. All right, we should get... Let's take this guy out. Um, got both of those. So there's a dead guy here. Let's see what he's got. Nothing. Don't need any of that. There should be some... Okay, that's better than nothing. Let's see what's in the fridge here. Nothing. We got in here. Water. Should I pipe? And that's about it. So, I might actually spend the night. Um, let's get on the roof if we can. Hey! You stupid zombie! They're running now, you see, so. Uh, we need to find the way. Onto the roof, if there is one. Um, I mean, we could barricade ourselves in here. Let's just open this up. Okay, there's some water there. Take that. Let's kill this guy. Oh, here we go. Yeah, this is what I wanted. Alright, awesome. Alright guys, this is where we're going to leave it for this episode. Hope you are enjoying this playthrough of 7 Days to Die. It's an awesome game. It's a lot of fun. Please remember to rate and comment. Subscribe if you haven't already to this new survival channel. And I'll see you guys in the next one. So, big you out. Thanks for watching.